Hello, this is Dr. Odorico. I am a general practitioner and I work in the University of Brest in France. I am presenting our article, How to Support Smoking Cessation in Primary Care and the Community, a Systematic Review of Intervention for the Prevention of Cardiovascular Diseases. Cardiovascular diseases are the first cause of mortality in the world. The most represented are myocardial infarction, such as heart attack and stroke. Smoking is a major risk factor for cardiovascular diseases and the aim of our paper was to identify effective non-pharmacological intervention to help people quit smoking to be feasible in a primary care or a community setting. So we carried out a systematic review of international guidelines on cardiovascular disease and smoking cessation and we found four behavioral change strategies that were effective. Self-help strategies, brief advice, multiple sessions, and community-based intervention. Self-help strategies were written or video documentation with no face-to-face -face counseling. Brief advice was one or two short consultation to provide information and advice, and it was more effective than usual care. Multiple session strategies were the most effective strategies. There were a series of meetings with people to raise awareness, help them change and prevent relapse. They were based on motivational interviewing, Prochaska stage of change, and cognitive behavioral therapy. Community-based intervention were public intervention in the community or workplaces, such as poster campaign, mass media, and conferences. They targeted multiple risk factors, and their, effect, their efficacy was unclear. In conclusion, different effective strategies to help people quit smoking were found to be effective. They have to be adapted in different settings. Brief advice seems more suitable for primary care, for example. As future perspectives, it would be interesting to train lay people or community health workers to implement multiple session strategies. Thank you for your attention.